Hi, I'm Mark. I'm a researcher at Agroscope and ETH Zurich. Since the beginnings of cropping systems, farmers around the world have been fighting against pest species in order to produce food of sufficient quality and quantity. Today, insect pests are causing huge economical damages on various levels. Yield losses, plant pathogen transmissions, increased pesticide applications and trade restrictions are costing several billion dollars each year. Climate change and globalization are enhancing this problem. In the near future, milder winters are expected to allow insects to move higher in altitude and latitude. Additionally, increasing global trade and the rising number of international travelers artificially help insect species to overcome natural barriers. Therefore, pressure from pests on crops is expected to increase. Meanwhile, the demand for food production is rising with the growing human population. One important step to reach a sustainable way of producing sufficient food is to advance in crop protection and pest management. To deal with the increasing pressure coming from insect pests in a sustainable way, reliable quantitative information on the potential future distribution of relevant pest species is required. Therefore, in this project we aim to investigate how the changing climate will affect the distribution of well-known insect pests under different climate change scenarios. Additionally, we investigate how the distribution of the host crops of these pests will change. This will give insights on the potential interactions between pests and hosts. To investigate the distribution of the study species, we use statistical models. Species distribution models, or SDMs, are powerful tools to investigate the habitat suitability of a species in an area where it does not occur and to gather information on its potential distribution. Occurrence data of a species are coupled with environmental variables to describe the species' climatic niche in a model. By projecting this model spatially, we can predict the potential distribution of a species. To forecast how the distribution of the pests will change in the future, we can project the model to future climate change scenarios. With the outputs of our models, we can forecast for each species if and when it has the potential of invading a certain area. This information can be used for decision makers as a basis for development and implementation of novel crop protection strategies.